Welcome to Bob's Bad Poetry Quarter. Bad poems read worse. Hello all. Ernest Hemingway is overrated. His fame leaves me exhausted and a wee bit jaded. I like Americans or Canadians. His work is the poetic version of constipated. But I'm pretty sure we get along, although I think he's just a punk. Because much like Ernest Hemingway, I as well love to get drunk. Bob's Bad Poetry Corner. Hello there, and greetings to all you real gamers and gatekeepers out there. Retro Rob here, and welcome to part five of six of this The Galco Collection on Evercade. Today's game, I am super, and I mean super happy to show you because it is something that I think is pretty darn unique. Today's game, 1994's Glass. A long time ago, aliens attacked us on Earth. Now it's our turn to fight back on their home planets by stripping each stage of its layer of glass to uncover the unexpected and surprising secrets beneath. Super excited for this one. It's got uh, pretty basic controls. There's three things here. I mean, well, if you don't count the D-pad, you got a shield, fire, and lay bomb. As always, I'm terrible at this game, so uh, expect that. Also note that this is, again, as I mentioned, part of the Evercade Galeco Arcade 1 collection. And it is, of course, a physical game. And each one of these games includes a cartridge, which is already in my console, and a basic manual, which is, yet again, for 20 bucks more than any Switch game seems to be able to muster. All right, let's get playing. All right, let's drop five quarters in. Representing $1.25 worth of gameplay. We'll hit start. Put things into boys mode. Because I'm a guy. Ready for Hell's World. One. Good old 90s. Digitized audio. Get that coin. So the point is I've got to uh, clear the board. Oh, come on. I should have hit my shield. Come on. Almost got it. There we go. Cleared level one. That's super exciting. Yeah. And there's a little hidden picture here. I have one shield left. I can also use these explosives. I was going to save these for the boss battle, though. Come on. Alright. Now, they need to die. Yoga Flame! Ooh, that was... Almost me just running into the guy. Come on. That was kind of BS. There we go. <laughs> I love that my guy pops open his cockpit and goes, Yeah! Yeah! It's good stuff. I'd have been pretty proud of myself in the arcade. Oop. 
absolutely hate that witch. I think I got it. I think we're going to be in a boss battle soon. I think it might be a cat. Alright, here we go. Release of bombs. Oh, he got me. Oh, no, no, no. You die. There we go. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. I'm hoping to make it to the level two boss. I should point out at this point that the original glass game was quite a bit saucier than what you're seeing here especially in the backgrounds, which were, of course, of scantily clad women or men, depending on what you picked. Now you just get yoga cats, apparently. That's good. Level Peace. Oh my. Yeah. Feel the yoga flame. No, don't do that, you jerk. No. Doing good. I like that there is a variety of enemies here. I think that's pretty nice. More, more cat pictures. Come on. More bombs. Uh-oh. Again, you kind of got to keep on top of them, but... At the same time... I hate the way he swings like that. No, don't... Oh! Don't you swing. There we go. Yeah! <laughs> I love that. Dancing kitten. Looks like. First we had flying kitten. Now we have dancing kitten. Uh, oh no! Yeah, I died. I was doing well for a while there, though. Get these corners out of the way. Oh. Well, that that was just dumb. I mean, that's just me. Let's see what a double shot looks like. Eh. I think it's double speedy, your little rotating thing. 
Almost there. Got it. Yoga cat, maybe? Yeah. Alright, here we go. Boss battle. I'm pretty proud of this. I'm I'm only like uh Ooh. Alright, I gotta take this guy out. Shield on. Oh. Seventy five cents in. Did it just reset his damage meter? There we go. I ain't scared of you anymore. You're not so much with your buddy, Dad. Watch, I'm gonna die. I just died. Oh, it reset his health. So it's very serious about... There we go. Very serious about its boss battles. No popping quarters in and just mashing your way through it. Oh, uh, and there we go. We've got, I don't know, yoga cat, I guess. Not really what I expected. All right, I made it through level two, but why don't we, uh, why don't we just go on to the next level and we'll, we'll run out the quarters on this one. Why not? I don't like his... I don't care for his nuts. Come on. What is that? I'm a little afraid of what I'm... Okay, it, it just converts to a regular. I don't care for him. I don't care for the cut of his jib. I'm gonna tell you that right now. <laughs> I, I don't get the pictures at all. It looks like she's wearing less and less though every level. Which is just amazing. and get him. Don't care about him. I'm doing fairly well on this one. Love it. Just loving it. Ooh, they're really... Come on. Another one of those things that just drops new blocks on. Come on. There we go. I have a feeling if I hit that guy, I'm gonna be killed, so. Oh! Ha! Victory.
The cat drawings are a little odd. Alright, boss battle time! Whoa. Oh, he got me. Shoot. It bothers me that his sail can harm me. There we go. And he's done for. There we go. Defeated. All right, that is it. I... Okay, so now she's putting clothes back on. That's good. All right, let's get a verdict on this. All right, folks, that wraps it up for 1994's Glass as played on the Evercade. I like this one a lot. It's something a little bit different. It kind of mixes kicks with just a basic shooter. I, I find this kind of game very enjoyable. I, I could have used without the, you know, the, the, the stripping gal. <laughs> that hasn't aged terribly well. Uh, also, I would say uh, graphically, for 1994, it would have been a hard sell in the arcades because there was a lot more graphically appealing games out there by that point. But, again... The sound effects and the gameplay are there, so I enjoyed it, and I'm actually more likely to go back to this one than many games that are on this collection, so thumbs up. I want to thank you very much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in a couple days. Bye!